My name is Gabe Siegel. I play striker for NYCFC. Yeah. It's, been, it's been awesome. Uh, not haven't been here for too too long. Uh, came in in January. Was very excited about that. Um, and yeah, it's been it's been awesome getting adjusted to the team. Uh, a lot of I knew some guys from before I came here, um, which helped the transition. And then also the coaching staff and everybody in the club has been very welcoming. So it's been great so far. Oh man, it was definitely a great experience over there. Um, I. Yeah, I came from college, then I went over to Germany, um, and I kind of, my thought process with that was like, why not? Like, when am I ever going to be able to move overseas and, and kind of pursue my dream like that? So I did it, and I think it was a great decision. Definitely helped me um, get to where I am now here, and I think helped me on the field and off the field be most prepared for it. I think that um, being so moving over there on your own and being so isolated away from home, not speaking the language and everything really challenges you. But I think you grow most out of the challenges you put yourself through. So I really felt like that was a good character development journey for me. I started playing soccer ever since I could walk, uh, ever since I could remember. My dad definitely got me into it with his job uh, working in the sports industry. He's a soccer agent, so it's definitely been pretty nice access to have and resource to have him guide me all throughout my uh, childhood and youth career and kind of have also being able to talk to professional players that he represented and learn how much it takes to and how much work you have to put in to get to being a professional which was always my dream ever since I was little to make it to this point and then uh, hopefully do, do the best I can with it. Um, yeah, so I, I wake up each morning uh, at 7.30 or something like that, take my shower, uh, get ready to, to go. It's about, from where I'm staying, it's about uh, 45 minutes to drive here. Um, you get breakfast with the team, uh, kind of catch up with everybody, and then from then on you're preparing for training. Uh, you get uh, into the gym and you're doing your stretching and then there's usually some meetings before training and then we do some more activation uh, to get a little bit more ready for training then get out on the, the pitch um, and then we work hard there and then uh, a lot of times there's gym session after where we put ourselves in you can do stay out longer if you want put more time in um, and then yeah lunch after that with the team again and uh, I think all day long you're also taking care of your body, so not not just when you're at the facility. I think that that's something that people don't always realize that, yeah, we do have a good amount of downtime after training each day, but you, you really have to be taking care of your body if you want to perform at your best, so that limits a lot of stuff you can do. Yeah, so I, right now, I, uh, I'm supposed to be doing some more classes because I, I left school early after three years and I pretty much finished. I did a good job, I think, of taking a lot of classes while I was there to finish up, but there's like one or two more that I have to do. Um, so it's slowly moving along in that uh, department. Um, and then I, I think with the rest of my time, I, I definitely, like most players, watch a lot of Netflix, uh, all, all the different shows that you can think about, I, I'm pretty into. Um, trying to get more into reading too and then I do love just being outside um, whether that be going on walks or just hanging out with friends outside um, I've try definitely tried to get into the city uh, once or more a week um, I think being so close to a major city like this an unbelievable city is uh, pretty lucky so I'm trying to make the most of that um, and yeah as I said before definitely outside of training I'm taking care of my body doing all, all the different. They give us some machines and everything to use that are nice. Uh, so definitely take advantage of the resources available here. Uh, I don't know to be honest. So I, I've definitely been, the food at the facility is amazing. So I, I've often just been taking whatever they have and I'm not they're nice enough to let me take it to go box many days. So I have that for dinner. Uh, good, 
Good, great food, better than I would cook. That's another thing I've, I've done in my free time. I think, uh, especially when I was in Germany, I started cooking a good amount. Um, but cheat day, if, I, if I'm gonna get something unhealthy, mm, I don't even know to be honest. I eat pretty healthy, I'd say. But if once in a while, a good burger definitely, definitely hits, so. <laughs> Uh, Instagram, Gabe.Siegel, um, don't have much of a following yet, but hopefully that, that improves, uh, but yeah, um, that's about it.